Here is where you will find 5G technology explained. How 5G works, why 5G is important and how it's changing the way the world connects and communicates. 5G is the fifth generation mobile network. It is a new global wireless standard after 4G. 5G is a new set of wireless technology that promises data connections at an incredible rate to your phone. 5G includes super high bandwidth and low latency stuff. Latency is basically the network response time. 5G will reduce the time taken for the phone to communicate with the cell tower to as low as 1 millisecond from 30 to 70 milliseconds taken in 4G LTE. 5G can provide speeds up to 1 Gbps. Imagine downloading an HD movie in few seconds. Isn't it cool? Today's wireless network have more people and more devices, consuming more data in specific bandwidth. This leads to slower service and drop connections. The solution is to open some new space in the spectrum. This is where the millimeter wave comes into play. Millimeter waves can carry more data with higher performances, but can't travel too far. Millimeter wave can be blocked by almost everything that comes into their way, even if it is your skin, which is good for peeps who are worried about cancer caused by the radio waves. To get around this problem, we will require antennas on every 100 meter, which leads us to our second quirk, small cell networks. We will use thousands of small versions of big cellular towers. This will help to transmit signals around obstacles. As a user moves behind an obstacle, his smartphone will connect to the next base station which will allow him to keep his connection. Networking through, the next quirk of 5G being the Massive MIMO. Massive MIMO stands for Multiple Input Multiple Output. The base station used by the current network supports only a specific amount of cellular traffic, but MIMO base station can support hundreds of ports which will increase the capacity of today's network. But there's a catch, all those ports in the base station sends data in every direction, which may lead to interference. This brings us to another technology, beamforming. It takes the signal and sends it towards that specific user. In simple words, it aims the signal rather than spraying it everywhere in every direction, which leads to minimized interference. But today's cellular towers comes with a drawback. It can either send data or receive data at a particular frequency, but can do both at the same time. Which brings us to our last quirk, full duplex. To overcome the struggle of sending and receiving data packages at the same time, we use different frequency for different functions. But 5G will use a more efficient method by using silicon transistors to create high speed switches. It is like a signaling system which helps us to use a particular frequency in both ways. 5G will be the foundation for virtual reality, augmented reality, autonomous driving, internet of things and many more. It will open doors to the stuff we can't even imagine. Media streaming will be a lot faster and 5G can make wired internet defunct. It will help network of machines and automated systems to adjust in real time. 5G will also help in true automotive automation, with self-driving cars for receiving data from sensors and sharing their positions with the cars around them. We can do stuff like remote surgery and drone control with the help of 5G. We can even make smart cities, for example, if an infrastructure needs to be repaired, it can tell that by itself with the help of a collection of sensors transmitting real-time data through 5G. With 5G, we can make a world that is connected, aware and responsive. But all these technologies will come at a price. 3G and 4G were relatively cheap as the countries were able to roll them out on existing band of frequencies. For 5G to work properly, it needs a frequency with much bigger bandwidth, which would require brand new infrastructure. It needs improvement in various aspects, including antenna designs, cell towers, and will require a higher and wider set of radio spectrum. You will need new phones and tablets with 5G radio inside to connect to the new 5G network. Your current 4G or 3G gear can tap into it. Testing 5G on the brand new 5G gear like smartphones, there were heating issues and the battery was draining out quickly. 5G is not ready yet, but once it will be ready, it will be like a dream. The coverage is going to drastically increase and slowly and gradually it's going to get more robust. When 5G is able to establish itself and fulfill its projected potential, it can change the face of internet forever.